Hi guys, welcome to AA Kitchen. In this video, we're going to be making Pinakurat style spiced vinegar. First, let's chop some garlic. Just crush them. There's no need to peel the skin. Next is the ginger. No need to peel and just roughly cut it. I'm using a 4 to 5 liter jar and that's going to be a lot of vinegar. And so I'm I'll be using several varieties of it. Use the knife to crush the ginger just like what I did with the garlic. Next, let's add the green and red chili peppers. It looks like a lot, but I'm also using a big container. So I think it's just enough. Next, let's chop one large onion. Next, let's add a bunch of cilantro. In Filipino, we call it one soy. Next, let's bruise the lemongrass. And chop them. About one half of the cucumber. No need to peel it also. Next is the radish or labanos. Add some whole black peppercorns. Like I've said, we're going to be using different types of vinegar. Uh, this one is Sukang Tuba. Next is cane vinegar. And lastly, it's just a uh, naturally fermented white vinegar. You can use other types of vinegar as you want. This is just my preference. Fish sauce for saltiness. Two to three tablespoons of banana ketchup. It's actually just for color, not for flavor. Give it a mix. Have a taste and adjust seasoning if needed. It needs more on my case. It looks like a lot, but uh, as I've said, it's a big container. cover and let it sit for a day or two. It looks good as a decoration actually. 
after two days use a blender to puree all the ingredients you may need to do it in batches just like what I did scoop out some vinegar then blend add salt to adjust for saltiness also sugar you can add as much sugar as you want can also add MSG for umami and here it is our homemade pina curat spiced vinegar it goes so well with many Filipino dishes in this video I'm gonna use it as a dipping sauce for my lechon belly try this recipe I can assure you you will love it thanks for watching guys and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel until next time bye